Yo, crew family, how's everybody doing? I hope everybody is having a blessed, beautiful day. Dream crew, dream crew, dream crew. They just wanna do it how we do. There is a new sneaker store that just opened up in LA and we are gonna go check it out. The difference between this sneaker store and all the other ones in LA is that this one is in Hollywood. So I'm excited to check this out because I feel like this store is gonna kill it here in LA. Originally, a few months ago, I was in Dallas and I stopped by their store and I did a whole video on their store and they kind of hinted at me that they're opening up an LA store. A few months later, it's finally here. So we're gonna go check out their store today and see what they have to offer. I honestly feel like today's one of those days where I just feel like cashing out. So we're gonna go together and check out what they have. Make sure you guys subscribe, join the crew if you have not. I would really appreciate it if you guys did something with you. Let's get out of here because we're gonna do some shopping. We're gonna buy some stuff. Let's go. Alright guys, so we just walked in. Now everyone is still setting up because they're literally like a day until the grand opening. We're gonna try to film around all of that, but I'm gonna show you guys some of the stuff they have in here. And uh, they got some crazy stuff. I'm already looking at this like Dior bike right there, which I've never seen. I'll, I'll show you guys a closer look at the luggage. I don't think we're gonna open it up. We'll take a look around. Let's see what they got in here. The first thing I noticed is this McDonald's bag. Oh my God. <laughs> Bro, they literally have all of the Yeezys here. Look at this colorway. I've, I've seen it before, but yeah, it's actually cute. every time I see it, it looks more and more pink. I like this colorway, but again, this is like, why do they keep doing gray with orange? How many freaking belugas are they gonna do? Oh, they have those? Yeah. What size is that? Is it's it a, a 10? Is it a 10? <gasps> wow. It's a 10? Everywhere we go, everything's a 10. I'm gonna throw this at you. <laughs> these are so fire. Like, I'm not an SB guy at all, but they killed it with these. 550 is not bad. I'll let oh you get Oh my god. I'll let you get something too. I don't want to just get something. I I've, I've been wanting those. I've literally bought nothing this whole year. We should make like a trolling video where we troll Mina all day long and just buy stuff that would piss her off because she wants it too. Let's not and say we did. They have these though. I mean, these might be your size. You like these? They have the brand new cars. These literally just dropped. Look at this. this is a, there's a bike in here. There's literally a Dior bike in here. 29 of 500. 150. Where does it say 500? Yeah, I think I, I'm blind. <laughs> 129 of 150. This what is a shoe literally do you not want? Warriors colorway Jordan 1. 160. Everything's a size 10. Yeah, today's my lucky day. I'm pissed. Wait, shout out to my guy right there. What's up, mommy? The ones you don't like. I actually really like these. You like every shoe. No, I think this it's one a is. disease. Bro, look at just how similar. I can't even tell. I feel like all of these are one color. But this one's cool. This one's kind of like a piss yellow. And then this one's like the poop emoji. So we know the inspiration behind these ones. I think this is the size 11. Damn, size I told 11. You that. But that one next to it looks like it's a small size, boo. If this was a size 10 and a half, I would have copped these. Just to piss you off, I'm going to get that small size next to what, it. This one? Yeah, let's see what size it is. Everyone, cross your fingers. Size seven. No. But you they could, fit small. But you they fit. Put that on my side over there. Really? You'd get. You'd wear these? Yeah. Why not? No. I feel like you don't like that. You're just trolling. No, You're I'm not. I'm not trolling. You like strange loves. I like those. Hello, bro. They actually do have a lot of heat here. Yeah, they do. The thing is, we've looked everywhere for yeah, this shoe for you, but we can't find it. So. So that means you get the shoe. I mean, if I find my size, let's keep looking. I know I keep saying this, but I did really want to get another pair of these. I'm so tired of hearing you these say that. These are so fire. And the Knicks fours, so sick. This is my size too. 300s not bad but i have a lot of fours so. Okay, so we just left the laboratory, guys. It was so crazy in there that I couldn't really do any shopping, but I'm gonna hit up the owner and I'm gonna see if we could pull back up later tonight. I'm gonna go get a haircut right now, put some food in my system so I can fully focus and figure out what your boy wants to buy. Like, but buying sneakers, you can't do it on an empty stomach. That's like trying to play basketball on an empty stomach. No, wait, that doesn't make sense. All right guys, so we have pulled back up to the lab. Now, the other day when we were here, they were setting up, so we got to get an early preview, but it's time to do some shopping. No more wasting time. 
right guys, we pulled up inside. As you can see, it's a lot more quieter and calmer today. To start things off, they've got this beautiful display right here. Most sneaker stores, when you walk in, you gotta have something that you know people can take photos of. Some bangers, they got off-white, Sean Witherspoons. Of course, you gotta have a pair of Kobe's since this is an LA store. These are beautiful, man. If this was a size 10. Uh, yeah, I think the thing that stands out the most is this middle display right here. Now, I don't know how many shoes on here. If you guys can count how many is on that wall, it's on both sides, comment down below. I'm not gonna count it. But yeah, this thing right here pops and it's pretty cool because if you come over here, they've got like the library ladder. So if they need to get a shoe from up there, they just slide the ladder over. Now, I've been told the ladder's kind of broken. So if I get on it, it's probably gonna break even more. Um, but for the most part, this is pretty sick. I mean, it's a full wall of Jordans and Dunks and Yeezys and everything. It's really, really crazy. Something that they didn't have the other day, the Travis Scott. What are these again? The Air uh, Nike React 2, 280 or something? I don't know what these are called, but honestly, in my opinion, I've been giving Travis a lot of love. You know, you guys already know that. But this has got to be his worst collaboration, okay? I get the idea of it. I don't know too much of the backstory of it, but it kind of looks like I painted it myself. Like, this looks like a DIY vibe. I do like this right here i didn't know that it was more of like a fur material right there i feel like this is just nike trying to use travis to sell their new sneaker and i think it was a bad vibe i don't i don't know i just to me it looks like it was kind of dip dyed in yellow or something like that i wouldn't mind if it was a better colorway i like the shoe itself but just the colorway of the shoe and what's going on with the shoe is too much for me like the, the, the air bubble looks foggy it looks like it's like 20 years old actually but let me know what you guys think do you guys think this is a like another great sneaker to the travis line i don't really see this shoe going for more than like 300 bucks in my opinion and i definitely will not be paying over resale for this shoe but the lab has them early like we don't even know when these come out so if you want to come get these don't know what size it is it's a size eight and a half yeah it's just not for me this is the first travis sneaker that's not for me also we got chris behind the camera for the first <laughs> time first time in how long huh Jeez. is that a world tour <laughs> girl's tour I always struggle with getting Supreme in LA, which sounds weird because You're lazy. Thing, I'm not lazy. You're lazy. I tried to sign up today because I feel like this Thursday's drop is fire. The North Face stuff is fire, but I don't have a plug. Like I don't have someone that hits me up like, yo, you need this. People, it, people in LA stingy, you know what I'm Damn. saying? So I'm like, with you. Uh, they don't <laughs> and I pay top dollar no I'm, I, I try to lowball I'm not gonna cap yeah they got they got dope supreme here they got babe here oh mm -hmm. is this a travel belt oh yeah, that's the, stupid like yeah, yeah I might get that from Mina because that's a baby Milo one that's pretty hard I honestly like babe accessories more than supreme accessories supreme is kind of lazy with it too I mean babe is you could claim that babe is kind of lazy too because it's just camo sometimes but supreme just be sometimes like just put a logo hella small or something look how beautiful this is did you get the pine green ones the new ones didn't like them at first, but I do kind of like them. It's like a matte tumble, which is I've never seen on a Jordan 1. This is pretty cool. I hate when they do this on Jordan 1s. I leather? hate the Why? leather Nike Air. I just hate it. And I hate when they do this on that the wing. I hate. I hate this. When my friend told me about that, I didn't get it anymore. I hate after this. That. Either paint it on or emboss it. Like, that's the best. These right here, when it's painted and embossed, that's the best. I hate when they do this little patch thing. And I hate when they do this, the Nike Air on a little leather tab. Like... I, those little things like that turn me off on sneakers. Bro, I've been dying to have these. Man. What? You want me to... Man. I never said I never liked these. Okay, says the one who had the pan leather ones. You're like, I don't want those. Yeah, I, didn't want, I don't oh, want the pan leather oh, ones. I got go. rid of them. Because oh. it was a woman's shoe and it fit weird. But this leather one, I've been seeing a lot of people wear them lately. It's fire, huh? It's fire, yeah. yeah. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> V-Lone Thug has these. Shout out to V-Lone Thug. The other day, I showed him the case. But this is what the bike looks like. They said I could ride it. So, can you guys... I don't want to keep it up there. They said they're going to keep it. Next time. Because we don't have a helmet, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay. Next time I'll be able to ride it. You know what I'm saying? On my Ryan Taylor. Oh, that's sick. Look at the little bag it comes in. Yeah, bro. Look, the paddles are see-through. You see the paddles? They're like transparent. All right. So now I'm going to grab some things. We're going to see what we're going to cop today. But let's check it out.
All right, guys, so we're actually getting a lot of things here today. We're getting, oh, you guys gotta check out this sick ass t shirt. Some vintage vibes, this old school NASA tee, but this is a sample tee, so it's printed on all four sides. When I say all four, I mean you gotta flip it inside out. It's literally has a whole bunch of different prints on it. So yeah, this one is sick. Definitely getting this one. Bandana box logo right here in the Navy. We're gonna get the newest cause that just came out. This one's sick. It's, he's like holding a mini cause. That's pretty cool. They gave me this jacket right here. This is a store jacket. Actually, this, this is crazy quality. It's got the patches and everything. And then I'm getting this from Mina. It's a travel belt. So you put this around your bag when you travel and it's a baby Milo one. Kind of a bad idea to do that because then people are gonna be like, oh, they got bape. So they might have bape inside. So let me steal the package, but it looks cool. And then I'm actually gonna get Chris this is you're getting this one the nasa tees are cool right this is a nasa tee it's nice not nasa i Ni am weak um, roast him roast I said him nasa roast him wow nascar sorry guys. roast this guy fear of gods now i was hoping they had that new colorway the the question is it called question or answer but we're getting the oatmeal i've always been a fan of oatmeal cereal so we got to get the oatmeal sneakers but yeah guys if you guys are interested in checking out the lab make sure you guys pull up if you're in la close to hollywood i'm gonna put their address instagram down below i always like to follow instagram accounts because you get to see what they have in store like even when i go into the store i'll pull up items that are on the instagram it's easier for me to shop rather than looking for that item i'll be like hey do you guys have this item so follow their instagram definitely if you are visiting la it's it's literally in the heart of hollywood so i'm sure you guys are gonna visit like the walk of fame and all that pull up here there's good food around here as well so this is like a dope area I'm really like I told them I'm, I'm happy they're not on Melrose because Melrose is so oversaturated now that it's time for change and this is the change and I'm really happy they're here. Dream crew, dream crew, dream crew. Yeah. They just wanna do it how we do. Yeah. Living my life like the Beatles. Yeah. I just pulled up with some lethal. Yeah. They get it mad and deceitful. Yeah. I make it hard to be peaceful. Yeah. They tell me I got an ego, yeah. but I'm putting up for my people.